tell me about phase three of the cell line project. What, what exactly is going on? Uh, phase three of the cell line project is an extension added on to the current area that we're putting trash into. Uh, so it's basically putting down the liner system. And the liner system is made up of several different layers of clay and plastic and gravel. And we have a leachate collection system in there. And it's all put there to protect the groundwater. And so, you know, tell, tell me a little bit about, you know, how, how far down is it going? How much, how much material is being used to make sure that the groundwater doesn't get contaminated? We have about six feet worth of liner system. And as I said before, it's several different layers of different kinds of materials. And the very top layer will actually be a couple feet of chipped tires. Um, one thing you're saying that was interesting was talking about sort of the amount of trash that's going into here. So um, how, how much, I guess, is, for total of the cell mine, how, how, how long will that be able to, you know, maintain the view? And then uh, I was also wondering if you can talk a little bit about sort of the amount of trash that is reusable or, or doesn't need to be here. Right, okay. Um, <clears throat> at the current rate that we're putting trash into here, it'll be about 20 years that cell nine will be filled. Um, however, we do have some choices. Each one of us has some choices that we can cut down on the amount of stuff that's coming into the landfill. Uh, we have waste sorts done every five or six years. And what we're finding from those waste sorts is approximately 50% of the materials coming in to be buried could either be recycled or composted or reused in some other way. So there's a lot of resources coming in and being buried in the landfill that really shouldn't be coming in and being buried. They should stay in the system.